What's up guys, it's Stealth here and we are back in Middle Year Solid Peace Walker. So I went ahead off camera and S-ranked that one mission we didn't do, I just went a little faster. Used the same guy in the sneaky suit and everything. Let's check this real quick. Almost to rank 4, perfect. Anyway, um, yeah, that's basically the whole gist of it. Um, there's no extra op mission to do, actually. We are uh, done with that, per se, for now. I got checked. There's nothing here. We may have a couple, like, boss missions, but everything else is s rank, so we're pretty good that way. It's like, more stuff we don't have to do later. So let's just get the ID card. Snake, to gain access to the lab, you'll need an ID card. You can get one from a guard in an orange jacket stationed in an area where you can hear Quetzal singing. To get the ID card from the soldier, do a body check. You've got to get inside that lab before the AI gets shipped out. Get a move on. So you have to go through all of the areas that we've explored for this act so far. So let's switch our camouflage, because we're not going to be just in the ruins anymore. Survival. Also, get rid of this thing, because it's totally worthless. And let's push forward. Now, remember, gotta listen for the Quetzals. There's no Quetzals. There's supposed to be a Quetzal singing close to where your target is located. Keep your ears open. That's gotta suck for the dude. I could probably take you right now, actually. I don't want to take too many of these run-of-the-mill soldiers. I want to get some scouts. Fulton recovery to helicopter is complete. Also some POWs while I'm at it. Fulton recovery subject confirmed on board helicopter. There also should be a dude out there. Key term should. What's that? Hi. Go to sleep. I'm gonna steal you. Fulton recovery helicopter is complete. Which way are you gonna go, soldier? Freeze. <gasps> He's like, oh god. And yoink. That'll make getting in here a lot easier the next time around. Bye bye. And I remember what the song of the Quetzal is, so when we get there, I'll know to look for the guy with the orange jacket. Usually it makes you go all the way down the hill, though. Which is really sucky. Once you know which soldier has the ID card, do a body check. To do a body check, first knock the soldier out, or put him to sleep, or hold him up. That works, too. Haha, <laughs> no alert phase for you, buddy. Alright, that's fine. That's fine for now. I know I saw something. He'll go to sleep eventually. Let's take these scouts. Let's equip some good old night vision just so we can see. Do you have any more surprises? Fulton recovery subject confirmed onboard helicopter. Hi, buddy. Are you asleep yet? Free. Ah! Yep, there we go. Let's take this scout. There we go. Now, there could be POWs. I'm not entirely certain. We got the one. There could be a second one. Somebody there. Huh. 
Whoops. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to startle you. Uh, there should be the only two in this area. Let's take you, buddy. And we have to go this way. Because the guy with the orange jacket could be in this area. Most likely not, but he could be. You're not him. But I'm knocking you out anyway. There's no Ketzel here. You have an orange ship. Like, it would be a very distinct sound from the rest of the ambient noise. Ambi ambient uh, surroundings. Ambiance. Ambient noise, ambiance. I think it's how you pronounce those things. Take this fool. Freeze. Get down. I actually put you to sleep while I'm at it because I don't want to deal with headaches later. Go to sleep. You'll go to sleep. I have one shot in my suppressor left. I can't afford to waste it. Where are you? Freeze. Was it really that dude in the orange jacket all the way back there? Was it really him? Freeze. Hey, buddy. I guess it really was him. I didn't hear the Ketzel song. Unless it was really quiet. Alright, I guess we go back. That's kind of disappointing. Oh well. The mission accounts for that in mission time, so it's okay. We'll be fine. We're probably still going to get our A rank. This dude's asleep. This dude's still there. He should be asleep, but he's not. Okay. We got both the POWs. Hey, buddy, I'm gonna do a body check on you. Is that all right? Snake, pick it up. Perfect. And I'm out of Fulton recovery system, so we just gotta book it back. This sniper should still be asleep. And we took out everybody in the other area. The issue will be getting through the last area, because I'm down to one shot on my suppressor. This 
why I can't wait to get a rank 5 a tranquilizer pistol, because that thing suppressor never runs out. It's a perma suppressor. I love it. Just equipping night vision just to see, scan, in case I missed anybody. I don't think I did, though. I think we're good. Up and at him. Oh boy. Ugh. 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 I can hope. I can hope that the dudes are knocked out. They are still knocked out. That makes life so much better. We got through here fast enough. Good. Alright, and this card ought to work. <sighs> Please work. It's a red card. All right. Excellent. It's open. Nice open area. Looks pr nice, actually. Waiting without joy or pleasure. Waiting for the one I despise. Don't move! Don't move. You men and your guns. You all say the same thing. I suppose you're here to destroy my research. Yes, I know. Just as I know what you did ten years ago. Go on. Kill me like you killed her. Kill me like you killed the boss! Kill me! What exactly do you... Come on, Snake. Or should I say Big Boss? That filthy title given you as reward for murder. Do you still wear it with pride? You chose a shadowy country over the mentor who made you what you are. You brought despair to good soldiers everywhere. You used the pretext of a mission to kill a true hero! Is that what you call loyalty? Answer me! The boss. Well, what do you have to say for yourself? She betrayed America. She stole a Davy Crockett and then defected to the other side. She used an American nuclear weapon to attack Soviet territory. The only way for Washington to prove its innocence to Moscow was to eliminate the traitor themselves. The boss's death was the only thing that could have prevented all-out nuclear war. Is that what you call the truth? It's the truth as it was told to me. So the truth is that you sullied the reputation of your mentor, the woman you love most in this world, before you buried her? It was my mission. Huh. So that's the conclusion you came to in order to live with yourself. What's the boss to you? I'm the one she abandoned when she left this world. I won't rest until I get answers from the woman I loved. You and I are the same. We are the walking dead. <sighs> Would you like to meet her? The boss is gone. Not so fast. You'd like to meet her, wouldn't you? I can arrange it. You took her life. I gave it back. You what? Care for a sniff? It's only snuff. You're a cigar man, aren't you? Well, there's no smoking in there, so if you want to meet her, you'd best partake now. <coughs> Follow me. 
This is my baby, my morpho butterfly. It's neither pupa nor cocoon, but an Amar girl. A complete individual in the fullest sense of the word. Is someone there? Uh, uh, we have a visitor. I'll introduce him. Don't try anything foolish. As long as we're in here, I can reduce you to carbon at the press of a button. Who are you? A man. A warfighter. I call it the Mammal Part. Mammal Part? For my participation on the project, I demanded access to all information on the boss. Everything the CIA had. Her personal history, military records, physiological data, correspondence, the files for every operation she took part in, every decision she ever made at every possible turn, what she took and what was taken from her. Her pain and her pleasure, her joy and sorrow, her life and death. And yes, even you. Why, why would you do that? Coldman sought an MAD-based AI that would deliver an effective retaliatory strike against the most appropriate target in response to a nuclear attack from a hypothetical adversary. An unmanned device to act as a deterrent capable of making the decisions and taking the actions that human beings cannot. I therefore concluded he required a cool, calculating machine, programmed to inflict swift, sure, and utter annihilation upon the enemy. No retaliation, but he took it upon himself to come up with a different answer. He said he needed the thought patterns of the very finest rational mind, one that thought on a global scale, took both past and future into consideration, and reached the best decision no matter how painful. And that's why you asked for everything they had on the boss. It was the logical thing to do. I knew of only one person who could be entrusted with the fate of the entire human race. What's your real goal here? To clear her name. Why was a legendary hero forced to betray her country? Why was she targeted for assassination by you, her most beloved disciple? I have no use for fabrications. I want the truth. The boss's last will. You must be dying to know yourself. No. No. She abandoned her country. Abandoned us all. Really? You think you understand her feelings? You're trying to recreate the boss's last will. Is that it? Why don't you ask her yourself? Jack. Jack? What? Jack? Boss. Jack! Boss. Jack! Go home. I'm not your boss anymore. Boss? Go home! No, I... Complete your mission, Snake. Extinguish that noble soul once again. If you can. Well, that's crazy. But yes, I will take all the discs, even though they're not gonna do anything. They don't do anything for me. Sadly. I wish they did. Give me. Go home. I'm not your boss anymore. Go home. Sorry, I gotta take these things from you. More discs for me. I'm not going home. More discs. What is this? 
his response. Oh god. Discontinue. Maybe you shouldn't have let me, you know, mess around with the thing in there and take all the discs out. Isn't it kind of important to you? Just wondering. I taught you all I could. The rest you needed to learn on your own. Techniques, sure. But what about how to think like a soldier? I screwed up there. Oh, darn it, I hit the triangle button again. I hate this sequence. This conversation did not take place here. Being patriotic. It means devoting yourself to your country. Back up. There we go. As long as we have loyalty to the end, there's no point in believing in anything, even in those we love. There's the triangle button. That's the way a soldier's supposed to think. The only thing we can believe in with absolute certainty is the mission. Death. Oh, dang it! As long as we have loyalty to the end, I hate no screwing the sequence up. Anything, even in those we love. That's the way a soldier's supposed to think. The only thing we can believe in with absolute certainty is the mission. Death. Oh, what? I did not expect as that. We have I hate men, this. There's no why? Do, well, I, I, I had the question why they added quick time events in this game. That's the way a soldier's supposed to think. The only thing we can believe in with absolute certainty is the mission. <laughs> I'm defecting to the Soviet Union. Jack. You can't come I probably us. got a B rank because I screwed up so much in that sequence. It was horrible. That was really, 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 really bad. Ugh, man. That was harder than I remembered it. Ugh. Ugh. Groggy. But I'm outside again. In the flowers, no less. Looks like they're taking the pot away. Darn it. Uh oh. Well, hi there, Chrysalis. Looks like you and I are about to finally have a throwdown. God, that took forever. This whole video was devoted to a single story mission. That's insane. Probably got an A rank. How about that? Despite me royally screwing up that sequence, I got an A rank. Sweet. Special report. Okay, what's the special report you've got for me? I think it's Outer Ops because I sent people on Outer Ops. Oh, we also finished the X-Plant for the level 4. However, we have two levels for the command center left, so we can't exactly do everything just yet. We had to get to rank 6. But we're slowly migrating away from the X-Plant. Alright. Staff. R&D, R&D. I need more missiles. 
Intel, 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 Intel. Combat. Medical team. There we go. Let's check on the outer ops teams. Nope. Stun boxes. Ooh, spicy curry, rank two. Okay. All right. What can we do R and D wise? All these weapons are done. What about items? Done, done, done. Uh. This needs to be leveled up. I'll level up these things. What about weapons? Holy cow, I actually have enough to finish everything I have. Alright. Very good. Okay, well, that's going to be it for this session, guys. Uh, when we return, we have to fight Chrysalis. That'll be loads of fun. But that's going to be it for me, guys. Uh, I will see you all in the next recording session. That's where we're going to start off. And I'm also going to make sure to recruit more soldiers via the online function before we begin that one. I hope you guys enjoy your day. See you next time.